Hey there everyone, it's your boy B3, back to another kicking toy review. Today we have more Schleich Dinos, last time we reviewed the Schleich Giga Noto Sore Ass, and today we have a Tawa. Yeah, so usually, <laughs> this is also from Schleich, usually when I review one of these dinosaurs, I know something about it, like I can give little factoids. I actually don't know anything about the Tawa. I just, there was like a 20% off sale going on, and I did the math, and I could get a Tawa for free if I got it with some of the other stuff I wanted. Like, the 20% off basically took care of the whole price of the Tawa. So I was like, yeah, I'll grab the Tawa. This is a cool looking dino, you know? I mean, it's not like super unique like a Therizinosaurus or anything, but it's a cool looking little dino, and I really like orange. I, I just like orange as a color. So I got him picked up the Schleich Tawa. So I won't be giving any little facts about this dude, but we can look at the figure. Seems like it might be an older one. The paint apps aren't as good as I feel like the modern Schleiches are, uh, especially uh, on the head and in the mouth. Let me move my hands so it'll focus a little better. You know, I mean, like the body sculpt and everything is fine. It's just the paint apps don't seem to be as good and there's no year on his tum tum with the other info. He's got some big old wide flat feet that's mostly just so he can stand well, you know? But it's still pretty noticeable, you know, just gonna and really suck on the <laughs> suck on those toes, you know? Pretty fun. No articulation on this guy. Uh nothing on the mouth. I guess they were just like, oh, it's a tiny little tiny mouth, so we won't uh do that but I do like how it's a brighter orange kind of on the feathery bits and I do love me some feathered dinos because I am a beta <laughs> anyways let's get into size comparisons here he is with the papo feathered velociraptor I also want to show him with uh, a safari figure so here he is with the safari postasuchus and of course, you know, I gotta show him with a Schleich. So here he is with the Schleich Donkleosleus. Yes, I know only one of the things I showed in size comparisons was a dinosaur, but sometimes you gotta mix it up, pup. And just to show him with a kaiju, because I like to show kaiju in these, here he is with the Retro Hedora. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. So yeah, this could be a fun little one for an adult collector. I doubt there are many toys of the Tawa out there because I honestly don't know what it is at all <laughs> and this is a good one for kids and I think it'll make a good display piece for adults as well I mean it's it seems to be pretty durable but it's also not super hard it's still a little soft uh, so this would be a good one for kids no small parts it's just one solid piece yeah very fun so that's it thank you all very much for your support please remember to rate comment and subscribe check out all the cool links you know, down in the description, we got a lot more reviews coming. I got a lot of Safari, Papo, and Schleich still. Not to mention a lot of Power Rangers, Godzilla, you know, some King Kong, DC Comics, Ultraman. Uh, still got a lot to review. Even a little Ninja Turtles. I, I don't think I've ever reviewed a Ninja Turtles figure, so that'll be interesting. Anyway, that's it. Thank you all once again. I'll see you all next time.